cheers and applause, Jimmy. The president had another preposterous day today. On Twitter this morning he did something very, very Trumpy. He tweeted an Ukwinnipiac poll, 66% of people feel the economy is excellent or good. That is the highest number ever recorded by this poll. True, the part of the poll he didn't mention is far more of the people polled believe President Obama is responsible for the stronger economy, not him. 49% to 40%. Not only that, 63% of those polled said President Trump is not honest. And 56% give him an FRD grade for his first year in office. Same poll that he tweeted. What a day it was today. They're all big days but this one. President Trump today. He rejected a bipartisan deal for the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals Program, DACA which is the program that protects young immigrants who are brought to the United States as children, people like Melania. Laughter, WHO and up here and, applause. Apparently what Trump objected to in the bipartisan plan was the senators from both sides WHO wanted to restore protections for immigrants from Haiti, El Salvador asked, a handful of African countries. They had to be rescued from difficult situations in those countries. Not only did Trump reject the plan, he said, and before I share with specifically he said, I would like you to keep in mind this is an actual quote from the actual President of the United States. We can put this up on screen and explain this. I apologize for using this word here. But this is a quote from the President. Why are we having all these people from, bleep, whole countries come here? Trump said. This is in the Washington Post. According to these people who are in the meeting, referring to African countries and Haiti, he then suggested that the United States go about bringing in people from other countries like Norway, whose prime minister he met with yesterday. Audience booing, Jimmy, I'm sure the fact that countries he described as, bleep, holes are mostly populated by people of color, and the immigrants he wants from Norway are not, is a coincidence. Laughter, if IT wasn't. It would mean we voted for a racist, like a real one, and we'd have to get pitchforks and chase him out of the White House. I also assume the White House would deny he said that. They did not. I just tried to spin IT. IT really is unfathomable. You just couldn't believe that this is the guy running our country. The only silver lining, and this is a small silver lining. The only silver lining action we got to hear Wolf Blitzer say this all day. Asshole. S hole, S hole, S hole, S hole, S hole, S hole. Jimmy, what an S hole. Cheers and applause, that would make a great alarm clock. So anyway.